There's a bigger creature, very interesting. Now, it's only showing us his tummy. It's a Suriname toad. They're very, very interesting creatures. I think this is the first time I actually am seeing one alive. Because I've only seen them in natural history museums, all pickled in formaldehyde and whatever else they use. I would love for you to show us the rest of you, but again, we can't command them around. Let's have a look at your toes. I can fix the camera. Okay, there's something interesting there. It has star-shaped sensory organs on the end of its fingers, and this is for him to be able to detect food. Well, that's a pretty cool thing. Let's try and look at the other one. Again, it's Tommy, and he's holding his head up above the water where I can't see it or turn to show it to you. But it has a very interesting back, and it's a shame that we can't get to see that now, because if I remember correctly from other things, other times that I read things about them, when it's time for them to have babies, the eggs are on its back. It's like under a layer of skin. And when they hatch, they actually throw through the skin, which is quite... Ah! But there you go. That's another interesting way of having babies. In the meantime, the Suriname toad slid down a bit. So, at least we can see it as a whole, head and all. Still only his tummy, but there we go.